my brother Jack and I went over on safari and we saw this scene at Lake Manyara. Not exactly like that, of course, because I move it around. I always kind of consider myself an ecological painter. I want to have habitat in the picture that has the ring of truth. And I would suggest that you, I couldn't have made up, I might have been able to make up the elephant, but it's doubtful, but I couldn't have made up that log that has a per particular quality of a dead tree. And so I would concentrate on when I'm gathering material to use in paintings, on little nondescript stuff that people would just go walking past. And the particular way the landscape gets disturbed by elephants' feet and the dry dustiness of it all. Putting a little dust between the mother and the calf. Obviously I'm playing with the drama of the lighting, having her shadow be silhouetting her against the light shining on the calf. I wanted the background to be um, completely uh, I guess you might even say boring, no, of no interest. The real background was full of all kinds of interesting leaves and branches and trees and very exciting and jazzy. And um, it, it gives an effect that I don't like in art and I call that the coleslaw effect. And if I could do a, um, a, a verbal or an audio what coleslaw is it sort of in other words it's all scattered in little bits and pieces and very distracting um, whereas I like to orchestrate I like to play down some things you know maybe the background would be the cellos or the basses quietly doing the underlying and then the elephants would maybe be the brass or something that stands out and you could imagine looking at that how that wouldn't work with a busy background which is what was really there. So that's what I mean. I use photography, but I, I change it for artistic purposes. The little window at the top is really important as well. Um, I, I, I don't know why, but I just felt it needed that little window. Everything in my paintings, I, I, I build them like, say, a watchmaker building a watch or a clock. I put all the elements together and if you took any of the elements and moved them around, then it shouldn't work anymore. At least it wouldn't work, according to me. That little window is exactly where I want it to be. It wouldn't be better if it was a few inches to the right or a few inches to the left. It should be just there and no bigger than that and no smaller. So everything is quite carefully thought about.